Samantha Divers. I'm machine control sales consultant for the South Island for a global survey. Um, this here is a 3D excavator, which is um, one of our most commonly sold products. So as you can see in the background here, we have a full calibrated 3D excavator in here. We've got a bit of a 3D pond design going around in the background. On This is our, pl our plan view of the side. Over on this side here, we've got our cross section view with our bucket. And up in the top corners here, we've got our cuts that we need to go to our design levels. So as we move the excavator around, the um, bucket position and every movement on this excavator represents every movement that you see of your machine when it's moving around site. As you cut down to grade, these levels here will come down and go green and then go down to being zero and zero when you get to the correct grade. If you get down and you cut too far, these levels will then turn blue and tell you you need to fill up. It's pretty straightforward. It is. Even I could understand that. Yeah, so it's, it's a nice, simple, easy, easy to use system we can go through. We can calibrate all your different buckets for your machines. We can have your trenching bucket, your rock bucket, your spade bucket, everything. And as all the buckets, as you move, move that machine, you'll see everything um, fully moved in the live thing on your picture. We've got heaps of different viewing options. So we've got our general overview, which most people dig from. We can then go to an extended overview, so we see a long section of the site. A cross section and then our plan view. We can go to a straight plan view. We uh, can have it in 2D so you guys can look at it in 2D and then we can go to 3D as a guy and zoom in and the guys can rotate this around in three in real world things to see their 3D design of what they're trying to what they're trying to achieve. We can also then purely look in section view which is quite handy with systems on graders, profile views, and then uh, cut and fill views for when you're doing big bulk earthwork sites.